Hello, everybody. This is <clears throat> this is Rowan Horden back again with another Q and A video. And where we last left off, we um, I answered some questions in episode forty four of season two, and now I'm gonna answer some more questions. So, <clears throat> so let's get started. Bobby Boy Burner, the intelligent YouTuber, asked, "What's your favorite color? Green." Do you have an opinion on Burger King or Hungry Jack's in Australia? It's a good restaurant. So, Sweet Licks the Lich- I'm sorry, tongue twister there. Sweet Licks the Witch asked, What's your favorite fruit? I like raspberries because... You get the reference. Anyway, um, and our last question for today is, who's your favorite Arietti character? Arietti, Arietti herself and Char. Or Sean in the US. Matthew Austin asked, what's your opinion on Wiggles videos? On the Wiggles videos, Woohoo Wiggly Gremlins and Hoopty Doo It's a Wiggly Party. For the former, it's pretty nostalgic. I remember watching it on DVD when I was young. And for the latter, I, it seems okay, but I never, but I've never watched it, but I might, but I'm probably going to give it a watch soon. Aiden Zacy Production asked, can you think of another joke about Mr. T? Let me think. I think I've, I think I've just thought of the perfect one. You better get ready for the spooky season. Because Darth Texie's gonna come and get you with his brand new Halloween costume. <laughs> yeah, that was my text impression. Sorry, my cat's in the way. What song do you like from the Wiggles? I like hats dressing up. Yeah, I like most of the 2002 songs. The Wiggle, the purse Wiggle Bay songs. Etc. Up until Racing to the Rainbow. Do you need help of a creepy pasta for Halloween? Or no? Uh, yeah. I need to think of a really, really, really creative creepy pasta that will totally be critically acclaimed and that every, most everyone will like. Well, a few of my subscribers, not everyone, will like my videos. So yeah, I need to think of a good story that should um that should entertain everyone and that and that way it will receive a lot of critical acclaim. Okay, um Martin the Kirby Movie Sonic and Parappa fan asks, Who is your favorite Sonic character? I like Sonic and Tails. <clears throat> Lewis the Rugrats and Robots fan second account asked. Do you watch crime shows? I used to watch Cops with my dad when I was young, but I don't really watch it anymore. Gem Lover asked, What's your childhood snack? I'd say Oreos. Can't really think of anything else. Would you rather be a vampire or a werewolf? I think a vampire. But I just need to stay away from sunlight, though. Sorry, my cat's in the way. You can see her tail. Have you got a job or volunteered someplace before? Yeah, I did work experience when I was in year 10 at school. And it was pretty good. Risk it out of the way. And yes, that was the cat who chased a mouse. What would you do if you woke up as the, the opposite gender? I'd be surprised. And if I were a female, my gender swap name will have to be Rhonda, because it has, um, the five same letters as my real name. R-O-H-A-N-N. What's your favorite Spider-Man villain? The Green Goblin. Heck, Willem Dafoe did a really good job portraying him. He was all like, um... 
You're an amazing creature, Spider-Man. You and I are not so different. What about my generous proposal? Are you in or are you out? I offered you friendship and you spat in my face. Er, one more. You know how much I sacrificed? Yeah, I can't really raise my voice very well in celebrity. In celebrity voices. Or impressions. So yeah. What's your opinion on how to basic? He's pretty funny, even though most of his videos are clickbaits. What's your opinion on the upcoming The Little Mermaid remake? It seems okay. I don't really care... I don't really care care about Disney remakes. I don't really hate everything I see. Every movie, every show, everything I see on television or on the internet. Unless if that person did something bad or if that movie received a lot of negative criticism. Taylor Marbell Rose asked, What do you think of Andy Samberg? I never heard of him. Have you ever tried Dairy Queen? No. There's no Dairy Queen in Australia, somehow. What's your opinion on the nut job 2, Nutty by Nature? I never saw it. Who's your favourite Monsters Inc. character? Sully, James P. Sullivan, and Mike Wazowski too, and Rendell Boggs. What's your opinion on Sing and Sing 2? They're good movies. Can you voice Peter Griffin? Uh, yes I can. Hey, Lewis, where are all the kids? And where's Stewie? Let me do the Peter Griffin laugh. <laughs> yeah, my face looks rather stupid. And here's his louder laugh. <laughs> Shut up, Meg. Yeah, just had to. Do you ever visit America? No, I don't. What do you think of Craig Robinson? I never heard of him. What's your opinion on Mr. Bean? I... He's good. And funny. When was the last time you made Spurs? February... T February... 13th. Alan the Feeble, Spider-Man, Sonic, and, um... And Mario fan asked... What is your favorite 1991 film? I can't really think of one, to be honest. What's your favorite Mario Kart game? Double Dash. Oh yeah. Who's the best Hulk actor? I don't really know. Do you prefer DVD or VHS? I prefer... Don't think I'm allowed to say both, but I'm gonna go with DVD. Because they're more modern. Who's the best Toy Story character? Woody. <sighs> Magic Blue asked, When did you get into Toy Story? Um, during my childhood. How long until the new Mario movie comes out? April 2023. And I'm pretty excited for the new trailer that will come out on October 6th. And when it comes out, I'm going to watch it with my Mario plush. And I'm also going to do a reaction video to it. Brendan, the DVD fan, asked, Did you go out for a special birthday dinner earlier this month? Uh, no. When did you get your bootleg DreamWorks DVDs? My mom burned them. What do you think of 21 Pilots? And what's your favorite song from that band? One... It's good, and two, heathens. Have you seen Cars on the Road on Disney Plus yet? Yes, I have. And it seems pretty good. What do you think of the laser DVD player that you got earlier this year? It's pretty good, and in high quality. What do you think of The Weeknd? Oh, I've heard of that, um, singer or band. Don't really know much about them. And my favorite song would have to be, But I Love It. Hey, uh... Adriana Kanska asked, 
Which food, fast food mascots do you like? I'd say Ronald McDonald. I don't really know. Which DreamWorks DVDs do you plan to get? I don't know. Maybe... I don't really know. Can't really make up my mind. What was the second movie you saw in cinemas? The Smurfs. The 2011 film. Which Muppet characters do you like? Kermit the Frog. This is my Kermit voice. Am I actually a Sesame Street character? Because... There were some scenes where Elmo interacted with me, so am I actually a Sesame Street character? If not, then why did Jim Henson make me? Why did he put, even put me in Sesame Street anyway? Yeah, I just had to. Are you excited for a final boss for my food mascots game, which is the TV boss? I don't know. What's your favorite McDonald's creepypasta by Aiden AC Productions? I don't know. Mackenzie Freeman asked, Are you excited for the trailer for the new Mario movie on October 6th? Yes, I am! And I'm gonna do a reaction video with it when it comes out. Avatar Mimsy asked, Who was the Prime Minister of Australia when you were born? Um, let me... This is probably going to sound like cheating, but I'm just going to look it up. Okay. John Howard. Yeah, John Howard was the Prime Minister. It's the Prime Minister! Yeah, I just had to make a stereotypical Australian voice. Who's your favorite YouTuber with over a million subscribers? Oh, I don't really know. Maybe Yummy Mash or Mark Player? I don't really know. Can you try, try doing an American accent? Uh, yeah, I can. Well, if any of you guys are my, um, are my longtime subscribers, you may have listened to my American accent back when I was, um, 14 to 17, but... I started speaking Australian in late 2019 because it was my natural accent. So if you excuse me, I'm gonna go grab a drink of water, so... Now, this is for the people who have subscribed to me since 2016. <clears throat> hey guys, Rowan Hordern here, uh, aka Pasta Boy, aka Hordern Ween. So, do you miss this accent or not? Because I sure miss this accent. But the reason I had an American accent was because I watched a lot of American accent in movies and shows when I was when I was young, so this explains a lot. Yeah. My American accent was was cringy back then. So I'm happy with my actual accent, which is my Australian accent. Anyway, back to the questions. What would you do if you had a billion dollars? I'd, um, buy some very expensive stuff. Maybe. And Marcus is cool 1998 asked, What's your favorite episode of The Simpsons? I don't really know. 
I think... I think... Uh, I can't really think. Damn. Ah, uh, this is gonna be an episode. This should be an episode. Maybe the one of the season one to season nine episodes? I don't really know. Can't really think of one. What do you like to order from Taco Bell? I don't have a Taco Bell in Australia. Um, maybe I do. I, but I never went there. Or, there is actually a Taco Bell in Australia, but I don't really go there. What kind of animation do you like better? Hand-drawn or comp computer animation? I'd say, um, computer animation. What's your opinion on Arthur? It's a good nostalgic show. It's a shame that it ended in, um, it's a shame it ended in late February. But it was, but it was part of my childhood. Have you ever had a near-death experience before? Uh, yeah. You guys probably remember when I talked to you about this last year, and I was running around the f running around the yard like a lunatic, and I suddenly lost balance and damaged my clavicle. And I didn't react to it much because I thought it wasn't a major injury, but it turned out it was it. But it turned out it did become a major injury, and. I damaged my clavicle, and I thought I was going to die then. But over the but over the two to three weeks, my clavicle got better, and I survived. So um yeah. Well, guys, those are all the questions for this episode. Um, leave some leave some good questions down below, and um. And make sure they're clean and not inappropriate nor personal. And remember to follow the rules in the pinned comment. And I'll be happy to answer them for you. All Fweeterson.